Hello, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Sharon, aka the Mel and the Nostalgic Runner. And this is, I actually decided to break this down to two parts. So, hair slash, um, so I did, by the way, <laughs> this is Ready to Go Outside series. And the first part was Ready to Go Outside series slash um, Get Fit With Me uh, presents accountability, motivation. So, all um, motivational, inspirational talk in the last video with me doing my hair at the same time. A little bit of the multitasking, if you will. So, but for this, all we're gonna do is just a real simple makeup look. And then we're out of here, because your girl's hungry. It's time for dinner for me. And without further ado, let's get into it. So, I've already cleaned my face. I already did all the things. Like, I got my eyebrows looking all right, brushed my teeth, you know, all that good stuff. So, we're gonna put the primer on. Because we know we want the skin to be smooth like the butter. Side note, I found out the other day that there is a filter on this that I was not, I didn't even know existed. I need to figure out where it's at though. I think, I don't even know where it was. It was interesting. I was like, what is this filter? I don't know if I'm ever going to find it. Because it was interesting. Whoop. Oh, this changes the brightness. Ah, didn't know I can do that. The way I be discovering things on my phone. <laughs> anyway, yes, now I'm looking extra shiny. But I noticed there's another thing on this and I can't figure it out. I'm wondering where is it? Child, okay, we're back. I, you're gonna laugh. So I am using a filter right now, but I was curious where the filter was. I was like, okay. I like this filter because it makes me look less washed out. This is actually how I normally look in the summer months, but I want to give summer all year round. Anyway, I don't know how I got distracted. Let's get back into the video. But I use my normal primer I always use. I just buy the cover girl. It doesn't have to be special. To me, I don't think it needs to be special. If you take good care of your skin and you don't have a lot of like pores, um, like open pores that basically if your skin doesn't break out easily and you have really, you take good care of your skin, I think any primer will do. But if you have a little bit more problem areas with the skin, then yeah, I would invest more into a decent primer. Um, but for me, I haven't had to do that in some time. Although lately I did because when I tell you, life has been lifing. Randomly here and there, I've just been getting really stressed out. To where I've just been having not really allergic reactions, but like reactions. And I don't know what that's about. Anyway. So, I'm covering all the problem areas. I normally would have my brush to blend with me, but I don't have it and I don't feel like getting it. So we're just going to, we're going to improvise. I think I can use my big blending brush and get it done. I actually have a brush specific to this. And for those, if you're wondering, yeah, I'm just putting my concealer on. I don't really invest heavy in makeup as far as like expensive makeup. I used to for a long time where I wore a lot more makeup, but I don't wear makeup often enough to me to justify it. Um, but yeah, anyway, I'm going to do a lot. I'm going to do mainly not makeup makeup look. So I'm not going to do much of the dark because I'm not dark right now. I am going to do a little bit of bronzer because y'all know I'm, a, I, I'm like obsessed with bronzers. So, we're going to make this look an extra light look today because I'm just not in the mood to go ridiculous. And plus, let's face it, for me, I feel like, child, it's time for me to get dinner. Um, <laughs> that's where I'm at with it. And that might be weird. So look, you see where I got everything at. And yeah, I did not finish blending. Like the concealer areas, I'm gonna do that real quick before I blend the other stuff. 
Okay, now we're gonna get this other stuff going and blended. debating whether I should wear a hair piece or not. <laughs> Just a random side note. I think I might go red. I don't know. How about it? If you're wondering while I'm looking at my hair, I'm like, yeah, I'm debating whether I should do that. But anyway, so I got that on. The next thing I'm going to do is a little bit of the blushy blush. Not too much on that. I was going to do snuffleupagus, but I'm not, I'm not feeling it. Um, so we're just going to do the regular, um, we're just gonna end up doing regular um, mascara and call it good. I'm not in the mood to do snuffleupagus of it all. I'm just not. Um, <sighs> I don't know. Anyway, I think that looks good. Um, so then I think I'm just gonna do. Mascara, um, clean the brows, I mean, do the brows, and then lipstick, and then I'm out the door. I, <laughs> the longer I took on my hair, the less I got motivated in the part one of the video. And for, for those who haven't checked it out, check out part one. Make sure you do that. But I just got less motivated the longer I was working on my hair. I was like, oh my gosh. And, I, and also, too, my stomach is like taken over <laughs> it's like girl if you don't go and get some food and cut it out so that's where i'm at with it so that's kind of where i'm like yeah do i really need to continue on with them you know, doing more than, than necessary. Okay, there we go. Um, there we go. Brows are looking good. Yeah, I just want to keep it simple when it comes with the brows and when it comes to the makeup. I just, I'm not in the mood to do too much. You know, sometimes you get in the mood. Sometimes I would decide I do more. It's not often, though, lately. In the winter months, my makeup is not as dynamic in the winter, um, other than darker um, lipstick. Summer months, I play with the look a lot more. But I'm sure once I have a little bit more free time, I'm actually excited for that because I feel like this content lately and you guys are probably even seeing it yourself and haven't said anything for those who stuck around thank you for being support for supporting my channel and just like following along my journey and by the way the year of this channel just passed <laughs> i've had this channel for a year now but i say all that to say i just feel like because i just been so busy um and not necessarily busy because I want to be busy, you know, with life and work, mainly work. Um, <laughs> and all the pressures and everything's been going on with that. And I'll get way more into it once I'm out of the woods there of everything that kind of transpired that, you know, you physically saw some changes with me and whatnot with that from, from when I started the channel. Um, and those who even know me longer have seen some changes too because... 
I used to be kind of, I used to be really athletic and a little bit more on the thinner side, but also age is part of it. I am very aware of that, but the stress of work I know has not been helping. And also, yeah, I just, the lack of a work-life balance has just been kind of a nightmare. I had one before the pandemic. <laughs> You know, I had one before the world ended. But, yeah, before the panorama, I had it. But, once that happened, and everyone, we were on a level playing field when it came to remote working, it kind of changed the dynamic. Um, it made it was like, oh, so you have more time for work. <laughs> it's just like, yeah. Because I had a little bit of an advantage before all that. I mean, truthfully. Uh. Even competitively had an advantage, to be honest. Like, because for those who have worked with me or have ever been, you know, in the same like industry or whatever as me, y'all already know. And even when it comes to the, the, before I was even working in Lincoln, when I had a different career path, it took two people to replace me. That is how I've always worked. But, yeah. Anyway. I'm loving this look. It's very simple and straight to the point. And it looks like I did a lot, but I didn't do much at all. That's my favorite kind of look. <laughs> and then we're going to finish it up with getting the outfit together. Um... I'm going to do the middle of the road big earrings. Jeez, these might be done soon. Yeah, these might be donezo soon. I don't know what it is, but I love me some big hoops. It's what I do. Oh, yeah. Yes, okay. And so the outfit, and the way I'm finishing up this outfit is I'm just gonna put a sweater on. Something casual, something, you know. The thing is thangin' as it should. And we out the door. Anyway, that does conclude the video. Please like, comment, subscribe to the channel if you get anything out of the content. It's your girl Sharon, aka the Melon and Nostalgic Runner, and I will see you next time. Bye.